growing Lagos economy, there is a breed of vocational and technically skilled individuals who wake up at the crack of dawn to challenge the four-year degree stereotype working class. They are well-respected craftsmen and women, adding value to the Nigerian economy in no small way. These self-employed business owners run on little or no bank loans and make great income with which they further empower the next generation. My child told me on the dad, I want to learn how to buy myself. I mean, it's good that we teach you when it's time, because I like to do it. They teach us key business lessons in financing. I borrowed 10,000 naira from my husband while I want to start my first business. Target market. My customers, they are engineers and they are architects, makeup artists. Clarity of vision. Ikoyi, Ajia Road, other, other, other big area. Yes, the building there is somebody that did the plumbing work. So I would love to do something, something bigger than that. In fusion. Product pricing. And when I make shots, uh, they pay 2,000 naira upward, long uh, 2,000 naira upward. Profitability. Say in a month, plus maintenance works, I uh, do make up to, uh, up to, around 50,000. Managing competition. And God has given me that talent. I'm very creative. I tend to think outside the box. I'm not to do an everyday tailoring or everyday sewing. I try to just do something different, be creative and playful with my materials. And human resources management. Well, first of all, they will start watching me. Start looking what I'm doing. So, as time goes on, I will give them paper. Like after like uh, two weeks or a month, I'll give them paper. Hey, I come and buy this board. Do it this way. I will hold your hand. Tell them how to direct the clipper. They end each day possibly more fulfilled than the average employee. And yes, we glean from their stories how to make it in Lagos.